Hello happy people! I'm back with another video and I know it's been a while since you all have seen my lovely face but I do apologize for my absence. Life has been crazy. Um, yeah, I've been traveling, trying to put my daughter in daycare. You know, I stopped nursing. So there's, you know, there's been a lot going on but I am back and I just wanted to give you all an update on how my year my no buy year slash low buy year from Bath and Body Works is going. Um, I've been doing really good, you guys. Like, yeah, I've only made small purchases for the purposes of um, purchasing items to specifically review for the channel. So outside of that, I haven't really made any purchases at Bath and Body Works. Um, but I'm gonna show you all um, kind of, you know, what I have gotten. I figured it would be good to give a recap of the entire year, even though like I officially announced my no buy year, I believe at the end of February, either at the end of February or early March, I still think it would be cool to go ahead and give you all an update for the entire year leading up to now. So in January, um, you know, they had the SAS sale. So the videos that I posted this year from the SAS sale was actually from last year's SAS sale. So I really didn't purchase too many items. I just hadn't had a chance to film them and release them. And so what I purchased this particular year um, from the SAS sale was, um, let's see, in January. Okay, so in January, I spent a total of $25.57. And I actually haven't even had a chance to haul those items. So that'll probably be my video for next Saturday because I honestly forgot all about this haul. So I'm actually in the process of um, organizing my entire Bath & Body Works collection. And so part of the reason I'm even doing this no buy is because I honestly, I'm, fe I'm forgetting about the items that I have in my collection because they're not out for me to see. So I got some new storage and um, things like that so that I can actually see my collection and so that I can actually use my collection. So yeah, so I did purchase, um, an, I did purchase some, some of their items from the semi-annual sale and it was $25.57. So that was what I purchased for the month of January. For the month of February, I'm so proud of myself y'all. I only spent $1.62 at Bath & Body Works and that was to use my free item coupon. I told you all the hack about how you can use your free item coupons twice. You purchase an order online, add an item into the cart that's very inexpensive so that you can uh, set it for store pickup and then you go pick up the item and then while you're there you use your actual coupon. And so I did that um, in the month of February and I'm going to show you guys what I purchased. So this was the order that I placed online. So I had a, a free item a coupon for up to $7.50 and so I ordered the strawberry pound cake um, body cream. Okay, and like I said, the shopping cart can't have zero dollars and zero cents, and so I threw in this little um, hand sanitizer holder. And so, yeah, I got these two items. It was a dollar and sixty-two cents, and strawberry pound cake. Let me see. And strawberry pound cake smells really good. I'm gonna read y'all the scent notes on this, just so you all can kind of, you know, know what I got here. So the scent notes on strawberry pound cake is fresh strawberries, golden shortcake, and whipped cream. Yeah, this stuff smells really good. I never jumped on the strawberry pound cake bandwagon back in the day because, you know, I'm not really into like overly sweet scents, which this kind of is borderline, but it smells really good. It just smells like a strawberry cake, you know, some nice fresh strawberries. So I picked that up and then when I went in store to give them my actual coupon, I picked up the whipped berry meringue, 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 yeah, meringue. And that's what that looks like. That's what the packaging looks like on this. Again, it was only for $7.50, so I had to get like travel size items. And so the scent notes on this one is fresh berries, whipped sugar, and fluffy vanilla. And let me get a whiff of this. Yeah, this smelled really good in stores. Like I really enjoyed this scent a lot. So it just smells like a nice, fresh, uh, creamy berry. Yeah, it smells like a nice, sweet, creamy berry scent. So, yeah, I really enjoy this scent a lot. I'll be excited to kind of use this. When can I use this scent? Hmm. Honestly, this is a scent that really can be used year-round. You'll probably get more enjoyment out of it during the summer months, though, to be honest. Like spring and summer months. But, yeah, this is a really nice scent. So, I got two kind of berry scents in that particular haul. And so, that was that's what happened in the month of February. In the month of March, I picked up... Um, the same thing, I had another free item coupon for $7.50 and so I did the exact same thing that I did with February. I spent $1.62 and I got three items. I did two items where I ordered online. So I did order um, another one of these. I mean these I think are the cheapest items that I can find on Bath & Body Works to where I can, to where my cart isn't $0.00. And so with that I also picked up the Fiji Sunshine Guavatini. 
So that's what that looks like. Okay. And then I'm going to read the scent notes on this as well. Scent notes on this is Sunkiss Guava, Fresh Orange, and Seaside Jasmine. I wanna, I'm going to put this item on so I can see what it smells like because I actually really want to test this one out. Ooh. Okay. It's a very tropical scent. I feel like I get hints of coconut in it. Maybe, maybe it's the guava. I don't know. But to me, I get like slight coconut vibes and... You can barely smell the orange in it. I feel like you can smell the jasmine more, actually. Yeah, it smells like... Like a fresh, um, slight coconut jasmine fruity scent. So, yeah, that is the Fuji Sunshine. Oops. That is the, the Fiji... I'm sorry, I said Fuji this whole time. The Fiji Sunshine Guavatini. And then, um, when I went in-store and picked these items up... I got this with my uh, free item coupon. This is the Pink Pineapple Sunrise, and that's what that looks like. I really like this scent a lot, you guys. Um, I think this was released this year. Oh, and it just smells so good. I've actually been using this as my hand cream. This hand cream is actually currently in my purse right now. And yeah, I've been really enjoying it. So um, let me redraw the scent notes on this one. So the scent notes on this is uh, Sweet Pink Pineapple, Palm Sugar, and Drenched Nectar. This does just smell like a really, really sweet pineapple scent. And I must say, I really enjoy it. And then also in the month of March, it was my birthday month. And so I just want to feature this item in here because I plan to use it and I thought it was pretty cool. But Sephora had a free birthday gift for me. And so I picked up the Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream and then the Weiss, and then the Weiss, the Rice Wash. So I thought this was pretty cool. I got this as a free birthday gift. The last few items that I got for free on my birthday, because y'all know if it's free, it's for me, okay? The last two items I got um, for my birthday is I had this. So from Ulta, I had a free birthday item. And then I also, they also sent me a free $10 off any item coupon. So for my free birthday item, I guess for the month of March, they had the Purity One Step Facial Cleanser. And so that's what this looks like. So I have a facial cleanser here from um, Purity slash Philosophy. I guess it's Philosophy, not Purity. But yeah, I have this. I'll be happy to use this. And then um, for my $10 off coupon, I purchased the Tree Hut Scrub from Ulta. Now, y'all correct me if I'm wrong, but are the Tree Hut Scrubs becoming more expensive? Because I feel like they used to be like $8.99 at Ulta. And when I went to go purchase it, it was over $10. It was like $10 and some change. And I'm like, why are these, why are these body scrubs so expensive? Like it's, that was really, like, I feel like the price of that is really high. But anywho, I had a $10 off coupon and I wanted a tree husk scrub. So that's what I ended up picking up with my free item. And so I got it in the scent Coco Colada. And y'all, this scent smells so good. I was tempted to get the lemon scent that they had, but I really, this Coco Colada was calling my name, y'all. Oh, it just smells so good. Oh, it just feels like a fresh, creamy coconut like a pina colada drink like it smells really good so yeah y'all i have this it says it's made with shea butter pineapple and coconut and that's exactly what it smells like so there we go it smells really tropical too so yeah i really like this scent a lot so i picked this up so this is also an item that i got for my birthday so yeah y'all make sure when it's your birthday you all are using your coupons actually let me show you all here this is my receipt and so I only spent 59 cents, well 49, yeah I only spent 49 cents here. So that's my receipt you guys. Um, so yeah, make sure, especially when it's your birthday month, make sure you guys are signed up for all of the emails um, from all these different stores and companies and such. And then when it's time for your birthday to come, go and redeem all y'all coupons. Like I was able to get a lot of stuff for free. And like I said, I still need to um, redeem my Bath & Body Works free birthday item. I just haven't had a chance to get it yet. So yeah, y'all make sure y'all using y'all coupons cause y'all know me, I like to save them coins. Okay, okay. <laughs> Speaking of items that I got for my birthday, I also wanted to mention um, some Bath & Body Works items that my also awesome sister got me. So I wanted to show you all. She got me a couple of Bath & Body Works items and then like some body care stuff, which I thought was just so sweet. She knows me too well, okay? So um, for Bath & Body Works, she picked me up the Bubbly Rosé. I do not have this scent in my collection at all and I'm super excited to have it and give it a try. So the scent notes on this is Pink Sparkling Rosé sweet blood orange and a splash of cranberry and y'all whoo this smells really good it smells like a nice fruity champagne that's what it smells like it smells like a nice fruity um sparkling champagne 
And you can definitely smell the hint of cranberry in there too. So I'm super excited to have this. Thank you, sis. I appreciate you. And then she also got me Frosted Cranberry, which y'all know is actually one of my top favorite candles from Bath & Body Works. One of my top favorite winter, can winter candles from Bath & Body Works. If you all have not seen my top favorite candles, you all should definitely check that video out. I'll link it down in the description. But yeah, y'all, I love me some Frosted Cranberry, okay? It smells so good. And the throw on these are really good as well. So the scent notes on it is Iced Cranberries, Bloodwoods, Red Apple, Tonka Bean with Natural Essential Oils. So yeah. This is a really good one. And then the last thing she got me was this right here, which is the Tuscan Hills Vanilla Almond Spa and Shower Set, okay? Yes, it comes with a towel wrap, a hair wrap, and a shower gel. So look at this, y'all. Isn't this so sweet? Like, I absolutely love this. So it has the little towel wrap here, as you guys can see, okay? And then um, this is the head wrap that it comes with. You got a loofah and I have this almond scented shower gel. So I'm super excited to use this. This was really sweet and really awesome. So yeah, once again, thank you, sis. I appreciate you. All these items are gonna go to great use. And then also too, I still have my birthday gift from Bath & Body Works that I need to go redeem. It's the same situation where it's like a, a free item of up to $7.50. Uh, with the purchase of an item and so I'll likely do this same three-piece combo this one <laughs> that's what I'm gonna call this list it's the three-piece combo I'm gonna do the same three-piece combo I'm gonna get one of these I'll find a body uh cream or lotion I want to try and then I'll get another one of these and so yeah oh and I also wanted to mention too I didn't even realize that they had this in the body cream I would have totally have wanted to get the pink pineapple sunrise in like the body cream and not necessarily the um hand cream but nonetheless it's still a good scent and i do like it so it is something that i might actually go out and purchase but for now i'm on my no buy low buy so it's gonna have to sit tight and i'm gonna have to just enjoy what i have so yeah y'all that is everything that is my update for my no buy year how are things going for you all how is your no buy going how is your low buy going um i'd love to hear updates are you all holding strong have y'all made any purchases if so would you get i still am interested i still watch haul videos i still watch people when they're talking about different scents and going through their collections you know mine has been going pretty good i'm pretty proud of myself i'm actually moving items out of my collection and in case you all didn't know i also post updates in my community tab um kind of giving you all updates um about like how my progress is going with my no buy year and then also with my 30 day challenge so if you all um want to see updates more frequently go ahead and check out my community tab because i'll be posting more updates over there like with pictures and such and so yeah y'all so that was my um update on my low buy no buy i hope you all enjoyed this video like i said it was long overdue so i hope you all enjoyed it definitely let me know you know, like I said, how your no buy year is going and how your 30 day challenge is going. I would love to chat with you all down in the comments. I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Saturdays in particular are my bath and body works videos. And I'm actually gonna go ahead and transition over to just like my body care hygiene videos because I think I'm gonna be venturing out into um, talking about more body care on my channel outside of bath and body works. Um, especially because, you know, I do use other items outside of that. So I'm gonna be featuring more items and possibly even you know a few hauls from like other places where I buy my body care from so just be on the lookout for that and then for the month of May you guys I just want to give you a heads up now my body care videos are actually going to be uploaded on Sundays of the month of May and that just works out a little bit better for me and my schedule and so for the month of May in particular, all of my body care hygiene videos will be posted on Sundays instead of Saturdays. And then after that, I'll go back to my regularly scheduled program. So yeah, if you all like what you saw here, definitely stick around, join the happy family. I'd love to have you all. And as always, you guys, leave some love in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye.